All right, welcome to another episode of the Plexus Software Blogcast. Today is a bonus episode. Uh, we're going to talk about our podcast where we talk, where we write about how to solve um, common business problems uh, using software. So Jared, as our intrepid uh, business development guy and who's been involved with uh, many implementations of our software on um, our cl- our customers, what are some common and business problems that you've seen businesses have that that uh, have chosen to come onto our software? Uh, yeah, some common problems um, typically almost always uh, involve around, I mean, obviously operations. Uh, it's either that or one of the very early ones we'll get is uh, just double entries. Mm-hmm. Um, I expected more people to come to me and say, I want to be paperless. Uh, okay. And... and Honestly, that I'm sure it's there for people, but um, it's that's priority. not quite there. Yeah, so that hasn't been there. Um, but mostly double, triple, actually quadruple entry. Uh, mm-hmm. So one of our current customers, um, I remember not long ago, was, was actually doing quadruple entry. <laughs> um, and so with some of our more niched customers, like uh, insulation, um, fireplaces, uh, they come to us for different reasons. So if somebody hears about us for fireplaces, it's because we have, can I say badass? <laughs> it's our badass, podcast. We can uh, estimating. I mean, it's just so slick. I mm. mean, uh, people will call it the grand slam. You know, it's just okay. it's unbelievable how perfect and how fast you can do something that was so slow and tedious before. Right. So, you know, it just kind of depends on the industry. But okay. in general, it's usually uh, looking for a seamless accounting integration, which has to do with double entry. Right. Um, looking to estimate quicker mm-hmm. uh, and 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 really kind of more of a holistic approach to their company. Okay, right. Trying to be able to have that overview. I know. Yeah, they don't want five softwares. Uh, right. That was the thing. That mm-hmm. fad is over. Um, mm-hmm. Used to be a, everything in one software, then it was best of breed, you know, have the four best softwares. Right. Somewhere along that line, it turned into eight softwares and um, lots of double entry and uh, lousy integrations and right, so, right. So yeah. yeah, having all these different systems talking to each other makes it tricky and messy sometimes with that data. Yeah, it has its advantages for sure, mm-hmm. um, but it seems to come with more cons. Uh, and uh, you know, a young system just can't do as much. You know, Plexus is twenty plus years old, so. right? So yeah, having those robustness. And so, in light of those problems that they experience, what are the kind of main solutions? to those problems that you've been able to do, you and the team have been able to bring about? Yeah, probably the, the first and foremost I'll start with is we have a seamless integration with QuickBooks Online. Mm. Uh, we had to make a choice. Uh, do you want three low-level mediocrity type integrations? Right. Or do you want one more in-depth one? Mm-hmm. Uh, it was clear to us that, that Intuit, being a very large company mm-hmm. and publicly traded, uh, was dumping a lot of money into QuickBooks Online. We were hoping it would do that because we made the idea and investment to start that integration a while ago. So it's been a good f- six years now, I believe. Right. Maybe only four. Um, of constant work on that integration. And so we integrate with chart of accounts, customers, invoices, purchase orders, um, sales tax, including the automated sales tax. And right. so that depth of that integration mm-hmm. across so many points uh, really eliminates a lot of double entry. Right, right. Uh, so that's probably one of the biggest ones. Mm-hmm. Um, as far as for everybody else, uh, mostly around the idea of really bringing their whole company down to one piece of software mm-hmm. rather than having to jump from one to the other uh, right. where you just lose a lot of time or you have to do that double entry. You just don't have to do the double entry. If you create a work order in our system, mm-hmm. that's the same record that's going to generate the invoice, the purchase orders. Everything's connected. Right, right. So that's a little bit more straightforward. Mm, that and really then that streamlines the operations. Absolutely, which feeds right into our seamless integration with QuickBooks Online. Because mm-hmm. what happens in Plexus happens in QuickBooks. Yeah, so uh, across the places where we integrate, um, Plexus is king, mm-hmm. what we always say. So create an invoice in Plexus. Uh, it's going to be in QBO. Delete an invoice in Plexus. It's going to delete it in QBO. Okay. Right, right. So it's kind of just the last stop for that little piece. Yep. So and on payments. We also have payments. 
the integrated payment so that people could actually so many manage. things we forget what yeah. they are <laughs> well and we wanted to manage people we wanted more information at the mm -hmm. hand of a, a tech or somebody like right. hey they're, they have unpaid bills you know mm -hmm. for some of the smaller businesses we work with right um that's a bigger need for some of the bigger ones not as much their tech's not worried about whether somebody's paying their bill but right uh for you know a, a 10 to 15 person company a lot of people worry about a lot of things right right they want to make sure uh, tech wants to make sure they're getting paid too because yep. they know it's going to depend on their paycheck. Everything yeah. is much more closely related. Right, right. Absolutely. We actually kind of really slow down, come to understand where they're at, their own technology levels, and we really can do a custom implementation, mm. um, whether that's going to be uh, holding more hands or just teaching and letting them do some. Uh, you know, we can help them make those decisions. So the main thing that I would say that we've really come to help people is sometimes they don't express their, their needs. They don't know they can ask for something. Mm -hmm. They just think, well, that's not something I can get out of a software or an experience. And so uh, they have their perceived problems, and mm -hmm. then they have the problems that you know we can actually address. A lot of those usually have to do with overviews. Mm -hmm. um, so we can do a lot of really cool overviews. And, um, can you describe you know, overviews? Yeah, us? so uh, overviews are going to be things like, the way your invoice w looks, the way your uh, work order looks. Uh, so in our system, we have one record, mm -hmm. and we can have lots of different ways to view it. Right. And so uh, it creates uh, that seamless transaction where you don't have to have all the double entry and all the official record. It's all one record. We just mm -hmm. look at it differently right. uh, from different people's point of view. All right, Jerry. Well, thank you for kind of answering those questions and enlightening us on sure. that. And thank you guys for joining us for another episode mm -hmm. of the special bonus episode of the blogcast. <laughs>